This report brought to you by the Richmond Club, where investors and high growth companies meet. Our next speaker is the CEO of Boardwalk Tech. Please welcome Mr. Andrew Duncan. Thanks everyone. Andy Duncan, I'm the CEO of Boardwalk Tech. It's my pleasure to be here. Um, let me give you a little bit of, of uh, background on Boardwalk. We have multiple patents. We are an enterprise software company based in Silicon Valley. We've been around for over 12 years. Management team has been together over 10. This happens to be my fifth software company now in Silicon Valley as founding CEO. Three made it, one didn't. You'll learn a lot from the ones that didn't make it, that's for sure. Um, we have a patent on a, what we call an enterprise digital ledger platform. What does that mean? What it means is that when you walk into a large enterprise today, we have customers like Coca-Cola as an example. They've spent literally over a billion dollars on enterprise resource planning products like SAP. But yet if you walk into a cubicle and ask someone, what are you really doing? They're really sitting there not working in SAP, but they're sitting there working in Microsoft Excel. And these Excel-based processes, which are rampant throughout every single company in the world, is really the basis of how companies get the job done. The problem is that our world is changing. These companies are having to move and make decisions very fast, and you need to be what we call 100% digital. In order to get to be 100% digital so that you can make decisions faster, you need to be able to move these manual-based processes into an electronic method, and that is what we do on our enterprise digital ledger platform. Again, we're proud to say that we have 26 of the Fortune 500 as customers today. Uh, we went public through the RTO process here. June 11th, we started trading. Uh, on that day, we also kicked off a brand new go-to-market strategy along with um, hired a brand new sales force. That work now on the go-to-market strategy and the sales force is really starting to kick in. Our revenue and our bookings are growing at a uh, very nice clip. And software company, we're running right now at 90 plus percent margins. So if you kind of take a look at our stock today and you look at the opportunity that's sitting there, we think it's a tremendous opportunity. Um, again, we're headquartered in Cupertino, uh, California. We also have an operation in Mumbai, India that's all of our own employees. Uh, we've got about 68 live applications that are up, mission critical. One of our largest customers is Apple Computer. We have 15 applications today up and running with Apple, mainly in their supply chain. We act as the intermediary between them and a lot of their suppliers and contract manufacturers. The ROI has been terrific for uh, companies like Apple. We also have about 2.2 billion cells under management, which we believe is the largest in our particular sector. And as far as the um, institutional ownership goes, uh, proud to have Fidelity as our largest institutional investor, uh, and they are happy so far and, uh, and holding and, and been a great supporter of the company. Um, Many of you have heard about and have watched the market over the past couple of years, especially here in Canada, around blockchain. The core base technology of blockchain is something called a digital ledger, which is a new way to manage and store data. It effectively allows you to be able to see a history of exactly what has happened over time. That is really important. And while we all got kind of balled up with cryptocurrency and mining, uh, the real value going forward, according to companies like McKinsey and Gartner, is going to be applying this digital ledger or blockchain technology in the enterprise. And that is really where this is going to change. And this is where when we walk into a company and we say, 
we know that you've spent a billion dollars on SAP, but we know you still are in a manual world, emailing spreadsheets around. You can't survive like that. You need to move that into a digital environment. And the way that you do that is you work with Boardwalk, you license our enterprise platform, and we will, with you as a partner, move all of those manual processes into an electronic environment. We recently had an opportunity with a very large manuf consumer manufacturing company that manufactures cereal. They spend $800 million on wheat alone in a year. Utilizing our system, we were able to show them that they could save 1% on their cost of wheat by implementing a digital ledger and instead of emailing spreadsheets around, actually utilizing a system where you had everyone connected, everyone trusted, and you had the history of what was going on so they could make decisions faster about when to acquire that wheat and when to basically pull the trigger on pricing. What's an ROI, uh, what's 1% on $800 million? It's 8 million bucks. So these are the examples that we see in the marketplace every day, all day. Um, when you look at what McKinsey says, that it's estimated that blockchain could save businesses at least $50 billion in B2B transactions by 2021. We think that this is a sea change that's happening in the marketplace today and that this technology is just as important and as when Larry Ellison introduced the relational database in the mid-1970s. That people are going to move their information away from old technology and into a digital ledger environment where they've got the trust, they've got the provenance, they can trace information and they've got the accountability. So again, uh, this is a list of some of our customers today. You can see it's a wide list, uh, all the way from Ernst & Young uh, utilizing us in their tax environment, to companies like Qualcomm and Coca-Cola and Apple and Accenture that actually builds applications on the Boardwalk platform. So we have a very wide market. When someone asks me what's the market potential of this, what's the opportunity, it's effectively unlimited. We believe that most companies today will have anywhere from four to 500 of these manually based processes that they're running, emailing spreadsheets around, that they're desperate to find a way to automate this and really move to a position of being 100% digital. So what we've developed is we've got multiple patents on this, but it's effectively enterprise blockchain in a box. It is a full stack platform. It's installed at every one of these customers that I just showed you. It has all of these, all of these components that make, it, make up basically a full stack digital ledger blockchain platform. It installs in about two hours. A company can install it behind their firewall or about 75% of these companies, we run it in a private cloud for them as a service. It takes about two hours to install and once you've got this installed and up and running, we then work with the company to be able to go and say, what's the most important manual process that you're running today and how do we move that from a manual environment to an electronic environment? much like the serial manufacturer that I talked about, right? Automatically being able to get to a very rapid ROI. This particular uh, platform, by the way, includes a new machine learning module that we've got. So this isn't just about moving stuff into an electronic world, but it's utilizing new technologies to allow people to understand what's happening and, and understand intelligently when to make decisions. Um, most of our implementations take about six weeks. Part of our India team that we have, we use a combined US and India team to help reduce the cost. But it takes about six weeks start to finish to build an application. At any one time, we'll have anywhere from 30 to 40 applications in development. We also have customers today that have their own people trained and they actually run around and deliver applications themselves on our platform. We also have partners like Accenture and McKinsey as an example that are trained and licensed by Boardwalk to be able to deliver applications 
to their customers. Uh, we manage data not only at the digital ledger, which is effectively a time-based database. When you put information into a regular relational database, you don't necessarily have time associated with it. They're overriding data. In a digital ledger, you're actually able to track the time and who made the change so that you've got a complete historical record of everything that has ever happened. We manage data at what we call the cell level and we track how many cells of data are actually moving around and today we've got over 2.2 billion cells of data um, under management showing this at a, a very rapid um, uh, CAGR uh, as we continue to build the, uh, build the business. Uh, this is an example of ROI that we have for uh, one of our terrific customers, which is uh, called Vineyard Vines. They're a, a apparel retailer and manufacturer in the United States. They said, we've got a problem with our apparel planning process, and what you see here is you see all of the areas in white are still applications to be developed and connected on the Boardwalk platform. The ones in blue we've already connected up. This is an example of where spreadsheets were used and moving them into an automated environment greatly helped them to improve their processes, delivering a uh, $1.3 million ROI in the first year. Uh, again, additional use cases that we have across companies like Heineken, Apple, Aon, a big insurance company, Rockwell Automation, where we help them connect up their distributors. Uh, Coca-Cola around customer relationship management and what's called trade promotion optimization. About eight billion dollars of trade promotion uh, uh, management is running through the boardwalk system on the Coca-Cola uh, for Coca-Cola. Um, how we make money is interesting. We go out to uh, again traditional blocking and tackling enterprise sales. We walk in, we say, we know you got a problem, you've got hundreds of applications that are out there, you need to move them into our digital ledger, we can show you how. We charge $250,000 on an annual recurring basis for the platform. We then charge $75,000 per application. We believe that most companies have about 100 applications that they could move into our platform immediately. We've put into our plan that they would move 10 over the next 36 to 48 months. 10 applications times $75,000 annual recurring gives us, plus the $250,000 platform, a million dollar annual recurring number on each client. We think we can get to 200 clients in the next 36 months, giving us $200 million of annual recurring revenue, not counting the uh, professional services that we deliver as well. Um, we, have, we, we very much measure everything in the company. I'm a big guy with regard to statistics. When we bring on a new sales executive, because of the recurring nature of our business, this is, uh, this is uh, kind of how that manifests itself. We're currently in the middle of doing a, a private placement. We've completed two tranches. Third tranche is going to be closing soon. And all of the money that we're raising right now is basically going towards sales and marketing. There's no technology risk here. The technology is done. While we still have some R&D going, it is a very exciting thing to add additional salespeople and start to see the value. Our financial snapshot, we've been growing uh, at a very rapid pace. Our pipeline and bookings are, um, are 2x of what they were. We've been growing quarter over quarter on a very nice, uh, on a very nice run rate and basis. And I would say that the most interesting slide, since this is an investment environment and community, is that when you look at a Silicon Valley based company that is very close to being profitable, we should be profitable before the end of our fiscal year or very fiscally conservative, um, we should be trading anywhere from five to six X of revenue. We currently are trading at less than one X of revenue. We believe that this is a tremendous opportunity for anyone that wants to get involved in the enterprise blockchain space, the enterprise digital ledger space, with the fact that we have 26 of the Fortune 500 as customers growing rapidly and a very dedicated management team. One last thing, in this current round that we're doing, my management team, including myself, 
uh, we put in 190,000 cash into the deal. It's how much we believe in it. It's also how much we believe that our stock is so depressed and it needs to, obviously it's gonna take off. So that is the story of Boardwalk. I will be around. Again, leading central digital ledger focused on the enterprise, 26 of the Fortune 500, uh, recurring revenue, um, high margins, 90% gross margins, and uh, quite a low valuation. So be honored to speak with you and to uh, take any questions uh, either now. If you enjoyed this video, please let us know. You've been watching the Richmond Club Report. If you've just come across this channel, please feel free to like and subscribe. I'm sure you'll find a lot of interesting and lucrative investment and trading ideas around here. We'll see you again soon on the next video. Cheers, guys. Have an amazing and profitable day.